Hi students, so I think this is the easiest question which they means have got. What they're saying is the ball is thrown from a point with a speed v0 at an elevation angle of theta. From the same point at the same stand. Um, first we'll draw the scenario and the ball is thrown from ground at an angle theta. At the same time, a person starts running with a speed b0 by 2. They are saying, will the person be able to catch the ball if yes or no and in what scenario? So we know that when we throw a ball with the speed b uh, up in the air, we have two velocity components. One velocity component in vertical direction and another in horizontal direction. At an angle theta, if we throw the ball, we have v cos theta in the horizontal direction and v sin theta in vertical direction. Now, if we draw a free body diagram of this, the only force acting on the ball is acceleration. Okay. And at this point, it will have some speed. And on the horizontal side, there is no other force acting on the ball. So on the horizontal side, we don't have any forces acting. So there is no force, so there is no acceleration. That means ball is supposed to keep moving with the same horizontal velocity, which is v cos theta, while it goes through change in its vertical speed. Well, it will uh, it will keep declining because of downward or negative acceleration, which is gravitational acceleration, to the point it becomes zero, and then the speed starts increasing on the vertical velocity uh, because now the acceleration and velocity are in the same direction before it hits the ground. So the horizontal side you have no force no acceleration the only thing which is responsible for horizontal motion is the cos theta now if this is speed is same as the speed of the person who starts from the ground at the same time in that case both will be able to meet again at this point so v cos theta is equal to v02 now we know that cos 60 is 1 by 2 so for v cos 60 it will be v0 by 2. That means yes at 60 degrees. Thank you.